What is going on people? Today's video is going to be about me and the purpose of this channel. I'm going to tell you guys exactly what I do and why I do it and why I love to do it. Can't wait man, can't wait to get into it. Plus I've been looking for a trailer for the longest. Uh, it's a little windy out here so you guys have to excuse me. I really hope you guys hear me. I feel like it's a tornado out here man. I'm not liking this cold weather. Not at all. I miss summer. Summer please. Come back. Please. So if you're new to this channel, or might be a subscriber, whatever the case might be, this is this video is going to be like an introduction to me. Got a couple errands I got to do. I got to head downtown on my way to the train station. I hate riding public transportation, just so you guys know. My name is James Raw and I'm from Philadelphia, PA. I like to call myself the creator motivator. I make videos to motivate all the creators around the world, man. No matter what kind of creator you are, it could whether it be YouTube, music, TV, it could be anything. If you are a creator, you're gonna love this channel, man, because I make videos to, 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 to motivate people to get up and just turn the camera on, man. Turn the light bulb on just to get things going, just to get things moving. If you have an idea, if you have a dream, you are a creator, man. It doesn't matter where you are as far as the creation, you are a creator. My main goal for this channel is to inspire all creators because the worst thing a creator can do is to give up. I really feel as though creators make the world go round. I don't think people appreciate creators enough in this world. People like you and me are very important to this world to create, to get out there and just and just and just take whatever is in your mind out in the real world. And the main goal is to make the world a better place. Usually my vlogs be under six minutes. I tried to do the Casey Neistat type vlog where I would just vlog literally right after I wake up and turn the camera off when I go to sleep at night. It just doesn't work for me, man. It just doesn't work for me. I'm more of a fast paced type guy. So, oh, hold on, get hit by none of these cars. I was watching the news last week and I saw this amazing museum that I've never been to ever downtown and uh, I just thought to myself next time I go downtown I will visit this museum I have to go it's like beautiful I gotta shoot a vlog down there these two tourists just asked me to take a picture for them that happens to me a lot that happens a lot people tend to see me and ask me to take a picture for them I don't know why because I look like a nice guy or they see me walk around with a camera I'm not sure but it's very flattering Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys, man. One of my pet peeves of riding public transportation is that when you have one person take over a two-person seat, that really grinds my gears. It, it, it's like, the train was literally crowded on my way here. There was this guy that was sitting in this two-person seat, occupying one seat, and with his extra light bag on the other seat. Could've easily just set the, you know, the book bag in his lap. We gotta do better, y'all, we gotta do better. We found it. I'm feeling pretty proud, man. I can't believe we found it. Roden Museum. When they were shooting the news down here, I kind of recognized the street signs and the streets and the roads and the trees and the chairs. So I had a pretty good idea what this museum was, but I'm pretty excited that I found it. Let's go inside. Now, one thing about the word 
creator. I honestly think creators are kind of underappreciated in a way. The reason why I say that is that without creators, how would this world would evolve, you know what I mean? I just think of people like Steve Jobs and you know Tyler Perry, Michael Jordan, Walt Disney, these people had a vision and had the guts and the will to bring their vision to life and it actually changed the world. My greatest fear as a creator motivator is that all of us have potential. We all have potential inside of us. My greatest fear is untapped potential. My greatest fear is for you to give up. Just imagine if Steve Jobs gave up on Apple, you know, especially with all the setbacks that he had, you know what I mean? Imagine if he gave up, we would have never had Apple. We would have never had the iPhone. We would have never had Pixar, you know what I mean? He actually got booted out his own company as well and just still kept striving. Because of that, he's legendary. I'm not saying that you have to be in the same level as the guys that I just named, but if you have an idea, like I said earlier in the video, you are a creator, man. You could change someone's life. And I make videos every day for you to see and, and, and to inspire you, to motivate you to, to turn on that camera and make something special. If I could just help one person, that's, that's just enough for me, man. I don't care about the money. I don't care about the subs. I don't care about the, the views. If I'm just able just to help one guy just one person that just come up to me like yo man you inspired me to just just to keep going just to keep pushing through it that is that, that's a win man that, that's that's my championship ring so if there's any message that i want to put out there man let's create a better world y'all let's make the world a better place i'm ending the vlog and uh thank you guys for watching this video make sure you hit the like button make sure you hit the subscribe button i'm going